Hi guys, it's Alex from ADBC and today I'm introducing our new version 3 products. This is something myself and the team have been working on for the last six months, really happy with the end product. So we've changed a lot of the bottles, the triggers, the heads, obviously the visuals as well and we've now got three new additions. So we've got interior cleaner, ceramic detailer and citrus pre-wash. That goes alongside our four normal products, the shampoo, wheel cleaner, snow foam and glass cleaner. Also new to the range, we've got new accessories. So we've got wash mitts for the paint. We've also got wheel mitts and the original wheel brush. Now everything's available in 500 mil, five litre and one litre. And today we're gonna to show you the full process on this VW Golf R. So the first part of the process on the Golf R is gonna be the wheels. We're gonna tackle these with a spray of AWC wheel cleaner. We spray this on, we let it dwell for about 15 to 20 seconds, and then we're gonna rinse off. Now in my wheel bucket here, I've got the AWC wheel brush, and I've also got the wheel mitts that we were talking about earlier. In the wheel bucket, we also add a few drops of AWC shampoo. This just gives it a bit of extra lubrication for when we're working on the wheels. So without further ado, we'll spray some wheel cleaner on and then rinse it off. So now that the wheels have been tackled on the Golf R, we're gonna go on to the paintwork. Now we're using a new product to start, and that's AWC Citrus Cleaner. It's a concentrated product when you buy it from us, and you can dilute it roughly one to 10. So if you buy a litre, it's gonna make 10 litres, really good value for money. So to start off with, we're gonna spray this on the whole of the vehicle. We'll leave it on for about two minutes, and then we're gonna rinse off. If you're working in direct sunlight, I'd recommend rinsing off straight away and leaving no dwell time. So the idea of a citrus cleaner is something to use just before the snow foam. It's a little bit stronger so it takes off that top surface dirt. Ideal if you're looking to keep your vehicle swirl free just because it means there's less dirt on the panel when it comes to that contact wash. So now that the citrus pre-wash has been used on the vehicle, we're gonna use AWC Snow Foam. It's a super thick foam at one to 10 dilution. So roughly 100 mil to one liter of product.
So we're now onto the snow foam part of the part of the process, which means that we've done the citrus cleaner to take off the contamination off the vehicle or that top surface dirt. And we've now got the snow foam on there, which is going to help build some lubrication when it comes to the two bucket method wash. Now I've got two buckets here, both with 15 litres of water, just water in this one. And then in our wash bucket, we've got AWC shampoo. Okay. We've also got the wash mitt from our store in the shampoo bucket. And how we tend to work here is we'll dip this in the wash bucket, which has got our shampoo in. We'll then work that into one panel in nice up and down soft motions. And once we've done one section, we're gonna come back to that rinse bucket, which is just water. We're gonna rinse that all out. So that just means all the dirt we've taken from that panel goes into that bucket. And we've now got a clean mitt to work on the next surface. So the Golf R's all rinsed off and we've noticed that the water beading isn't behaving very well, which means that there's very limited waxes, sealants or quick detailers on there. We want the water to repel, to repel off the paintwork, just means it's a lot easier to clean and maintain. So it's a new product we're going to use as a 50-50 test here and it's our ceramic detailer. Now the bonnet wasn't beading very well as I mentioned, so we'll spray this on and we'll check out the difference. So a new addition to the range is our ceramic detailer, which is an SIO2 infused quick detailer. The whole idea of this is to offer a super easy application with great gloss and around about three months of protection. You could use it on its own, so with a car that's got no beading and that'll improve it. Or if you've got a ceramic coating or a wax in your vehicle, topping it up with this every few weeks is gonna offer the pinnacle of protection. Now, super easy to use simply one or two sprays onto the uh, applicator, one spray onto the panel, and then we're just gonna work the product in right down to the bottom, and as easy as turning the cloth over and buffing off, and that will reveal that super nice, fresh, glossy finish. So AWC Glass Cleaner, probably our most popular product, super streak free finish and nice and easy to use. So we just spray that on, wipe on, turn the cloth and buff off. One or two sprays per panel. Wipe it in. And then we'll turn the cloth and buff off.
Now you can also use AWC glass cleaner on the interior of a vehicle, especially one like this where it's got a lot of gloss black surrounds and multimedia clusters. You don't need as much, just a simple spray and then very gently working it around the sat nav screens and the gloss black sections. And again, because it's alcohol based, it just leaves that street free finish on the gloss black areas. So a new product to the range is the AWC Interior Cleaner. It's a really versatile product. You can use it on everything. So your steering wheels, your leathers, your carpets, dash and door cards. And you can do this in two ways. If the vehicle is looking quite clean and just needs a dust over, you can just spray this on, wipe it on and wipe it off. And that will dry to a nice matte finish. Now, if your leathers are looking a bit tired, looking a bit glossy like this steering wheel, what you can do is you can just spray the product on and then use something like a detailing brush. And we're just gonna work this in and you'll see it will, sud it will kind of sud up quite nicely. Once we work this in, we'll then again, just take this off with the cloth and we should be left with some real nice matte OEM leather. So there we have it, all of the V3 products used on this VW Golf R. We've been super excited to launch these products over the last few months and we've put a lot of time into all the small details, the stickers, the fill, the quality and the finish of the actual ingredients inside. If you want to learn more about the products or interested in purchasing anything, all the links will be down below and we look forward to showing you more products and cars in the next video.